Hi, this is Cast Iron Chef Shih Tzu Shiatsu, and I am excited to show you what I am doing today, what I will be making for you. As you can see, we are out here in actual Amish. This is sticks and barns. We're in the fields right now. And this is gonna be a treat. What I have prepared for you today is two-time sausage, hot Italian sausage cooked two ways. There's a little trick I learned from Bobby Flay back in the 90s. Um, my, the first preparation is going to be, uh, it's going to be seared on a hot cast iron skillet, which is bubbling as we speak. And it is going to be topped with traditional onion, pepper, a little salt, a little black pepper, peppercorn medley, uh, and I'm going to drape it over a roll with uh, habanero cheese and a little hot brown mustard on top there. And the second type of sausage is going to be a hot Italian sausage with a almond butter, spicy almond butter, Asian style uh, puree laid over the roll and topped with a little uh, seedless blackberry jelly. All right, let's get to it. See, over here I have preparing the cast iron and a little uh, hot pot. Right there, that's gonna be a little something special for us later. Now that's starting to smoke here, so let's grab these sausages right here and just, there you go. Oh, I can drop that one. Very good. Yes, that's looking good there. Okay, it'll smell. Oh, oh, that smell good. Oh yeah. All right, those are plumping up nice there. And um, all right, now, as the sausages cook, uh, sorry, I had a little something in my nose. As the sausages cook, <laughs> my my hairpiece that I spent so much money on, uh, Morimoto gave this to me as a Christmas gift uh, in the late uh, 2000s. Uh, as I let the sausages cook, I'm going to tend to the preparation of the onion and red pepper. Okay, so what I'm going to do is take that nice red pepper, beautiful um, red pepper. I'm going to put it on my cutting board here on my lap, and I'm going to take, um, I got a nice little bag here, good stuff. Uh, I'm going to take this, this knife here. And I'm gonna and I'm gonna start cutting this pepper here. And w w I hope you'll be able to see this. Let's fix the uh, camera right here so you can see the technique. All right. Now we're just gonna cut just like that, a little piece, little, little. Whoa! <laughs> Tricked you. All right. Well, I'm gonna. You can watch me from the bottom while I cut this red pepper, and this will be. Very exciting when it's all done. Uh, I'm gonna have to keep um, picking up these pieces of pepper that have fallen into the grass, but that's okay because nature is our friend. We live on earth, we love the earth, the earth loves us back. It is all we have in a way. So this red pepper is smelling gorgeous, beautiful, freshly picked from the gardens of Sweden. Um, it is sweet. Um, uh, as the Swedish people would call it, svit. Um, it is filled with seeds, so I'm going to dispose of those in the gardens of Amish here. Now, all right, this, this pepper needs to be thin enough to complement our sausage well. Um, so you can see my progress right here. We have, uh, it's looking good. They're a little thick right now, but it's nothing some hard work and dedication can't fix, right? Okay, so now we're just going to cut these peppers a little, a little harder, a little tougher there. 
Oh, that sausage is smelling good. Oh, I'll tell you what, life is beautiful. Um, we are working on an Ozark Trail double burner grill. It is a very high quality uh, propane grill. Nothing but the best. I, I talked to the Amish earlier and they told me to stay far away from electricity. So I'm using a propane grill. Um, this is has been planned for a while. Um, and let's see how these sausages are doing. Ooh, they're smoking good. Let's turn them, give them a, ooh, wow. You see that black line there? That's what we're going for. That's what we're looking for right here. Now let's just grab that, ouch, okay? And we'll turn that sausage to, oh, that's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. How's the kettle doing? Ooh, it's heating up nice. Very good. She'll start whistling in a little bit when she's ready. All right, now let's get back to the peppers here. Those are chopped up fine. So we're going to put those in a paper towel here. Um, something everybody should do after they finish prepping their vegetables, you should wrap it in a paper towel. That kind of gets the excess water and liquid off of them, just like that, and uh, let them sit in the grass for a little bit. Now, now over here, we have a nice yellow onion. This is a cooking onion. This is one of the sweetest, most delectable onions on earth. Oh, I can't wait. All right, now let's grab this plate here. Um, and it looks a little uh, abused there from the pepper. That's all right, we just got another lovely vegetable to cut. Now let's see if you can watch this one, because this is very important you pay attention to the technique. And it's hard to talk while I balance the phone in my chin. Now, let's see. Uh, we're gonna, okay, there we go. All right. We got one slice, and we're gonna have two fat slices. Oh, tricked you again! All right, now um, we're we have two fat slices of onion here. I'm going to de-skin them. Um, I'm just going to take off the skin. I'm going to peel the skin off. I'm gonna I'm gonna just slowly take off the skin and toss the disposables in to the gardens of Amish. Now, when the onion is freshly de-skinned, ooh, that sausage is smoking good. I'm gonna turn that down just a little bit. All right, so she's gonna be looking good. Now, I'm gonna cut this onion very, very small here. Now, I, I like to cut my onion small so it really, uh, hides the strong taste an onion gives. It'll, it'll, the taste of an onion could really choke a cow to vomit status. Now, I, um, I'm really just kind of chopping this up very fine. Um, I, I just sharpened this knife before I came out here, so this is looking perfect. Now, let's take a look. Now, that's nice here. Now, we're going to put these onions in with this pepper medley right over here and that 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 is what we're looking for right here okay now we're gonna cover those up get rid of that moisture all right now let's take a look at these sausages oh looking beautiful that is look ooh that's dark there we're gonna roll that guy on his side there all right and same thing with this one oh yeah all right now they're looking good okay now as these sausages cook, we're gonna we're gonna uh, be friends with two birds uh, with one stone here. Uh, we're gonna make friends today. Now, what I have here is a little chili garlic sauce. This is a, one of the greatest inventions of mankind. This is superb sauce. This um, comes from straight from Hong Fong Foods Incorporated. Um, in the Canyon Road in Irwindale, California. And this is superb. So we're gonna put this over to the side here and we're going to get our almond butter, Marathon almond butter, also one of the best. So creamy, so delectable, so sweet. Uh, it'll knock your socks off, let me tell you. Now let me, uh, let me prepare, I mean, I should've, uh, should've, I'm gonna lock this so you can see how I open this there. Very good. 
Just open that almond butter just like that. And what I have prepared is a little cup to mix this up in. So we're gonna put that right here and we're gonna take our handy dandy fork and we're going to get some almond butter out of there just a little bit we don't need to go crazy with this folks and we're gonna put that into our cup right here okay now all right maybe just a little more that's what we need okay now we need to take some of this Hong Fong sauce and we're going to do the same thing we're gonna wrap it in the legs and open it up just like that just like this and we're gonna ow and we're gonna open that up just like that mm, mm, mm. it's wonderful we're just gonna take just a smidgen of that out of there put it right in there stir that up we gotta stir that up good okay stir it stir it stir it get a closer look at that very good we stir 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 all right that's looking good now let's check our sausages oh 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 it's getting hot we're gonna have to turn that down a little bit and we're gonna oh that's looking good though very very good how's the kettle ah, how hot that's hot you see it bubbling in the top there that's a telltale sign of it being almost ready so we're almost ready to get cooking here now let's uh let's really uh focus in on the next step of this creation we have going on here um, we're going to we're going to get our spices ready a little peppercorn medley wonderful we have a little crushed red pepper for the vegetables there this is going to be a spicy dish I love spicy dishes it's it's so wonderful to be part of this world and get to eat spicy food I um, I just love it so much, uh, it's really hard to tell you um, the extent. Now, hi, we're out here in Amish. I got the spicy food ready, I got the spicy dishes ready. Our, our sausages are really, really smoking here. They're almost done, so it's time to put in the pepper and onion medley. Let's do this here. All right, so you grab it in the paper towels, you, you wrap it up nice like this, and you dump it into, into, oh, there's a little grass in there. That should be all right. Um, yeah, that'll be okay. I'm gonna grab the pieces that I missed and throw them in there. Let's get that out of there. We'll leave that one in there for good measure. It can't hurt us, it's part of the earth. Now, let's, let's see. We have our seedless blackberry jam. This is the main event that I've been telling you about. Now, we're just gonna put that over to the side because we're gonna get to that in a second. Now, let's see. We'll just stir these around. Ouch, ow, ow. Mm. We're gonna stir this around for a little bit until those uh, veggies cook real nice. We're gonna put some olive oil in there. Now, let's just open up this olive oil and really oh it just overflowed all over my hand okay all right now let's just put a little bit in there not too much or she'll start smoking all right look at that she's already going she's she's lit up okay now that that is a wonderful thing right there now so shake off our plate here this is our serving plate. This is what we're going to eat off of, so it's got to be nice and clean. So, these are almost done here. We just need to stir them up a little more. We're going to take this sausage to stir. This is a technique um, ow, that I learned from an old chef a long time ago named Art. Uh, we had a very friendly relationship going on and he taught me a lot of secrets a lot of cooking secrets and I love him dearly um, so let's go here and now this is all almost looking nice let's feel this handle Ooh, this is getting hot that's hot but it's still good enough to all right very good now okay now this is looking good so I don't know which ways off here um, 
there. Okay, so that should be turned off now. So what we're gonna need to do now is turn the coffee off because I believe the coffee should be ready as well. So everything is looking wonderful. Um, we're going to get at it right here in one second. Um, so let's get our serving plate ready. Let's get our rolls ready. And let's take a second to admire the surroundings. Isn't that beautiful? You hear the little birdie over there? That birdie's singing for me. Singing for us. Now, let's open up this roll here. There we go. That's perfect. Because that's just going to drape inside there. It doesn't really matter how uh, clean of a cut you make in the roll. As long as it just holds the sausage. Okay. So I'm going to put this roll on this plate here. And I'm going to take a sausage. And boom. We're going to put that nice on there. We're going to take one more roll. And this is going to be the peanut butter roll. So this one's got to be a little cleaner. There, see? You just dig your fingers in there. Nice, simple, easy. See? Splits apart like two peas with some rice. And then we're going to put that right in there. And um, we're going to take this sausage and throw it right on top there. That's a wonderful thing. Now, these vegetables, we're going to have to get these out. I'll be with you in one second. All right, Chef Shitsu Shiatsu here at Amish, and I'm here to get these vegetables out of this hot cast iron skillet, drape them over this sausage on this roll, put a little spicy brown mustard, little uh, habanero cheese, and this is going to be gorgeous. This is a beautiful day. I cannot wait to eat this with some lovely coffee, organic Brazilian origin coffee. Uh, this is going to be wonderful. I smell the fresh dew in the air. It just rained a few moments earlier. Um, this is uh, this is a great day, great day to be alive. All right, let's see. Let's see what we got going on here. We got these vegetables. They're cooking. A, oh, they're charred up nice. That's what you're looking for. That little black on there. Get that. And we're going to get those vegetables. We're going to bring this plate close because we ain't got no fire on here now. We don't got it on there yet. So let's just, let's just, let's just push this kettle over a little bit. Okay, that's not going to work. Um, so we're just going to lay this right there and we're going to take these, take these vegetables and we're just going to slowly just drape, 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 drape. Drape, 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 drape. Very good. Okay, there's a little onion on top of there. And a little pepper on top of there. All right. And, oh, wonderful looking pepper. That is so nice. All right. Okay, now that looks delicious. Uh, let's get a closer look at that. Beautiful. And now for the fun part. We're gonna take our almond butter, spicy hong, uh, uh, what is the name? Um, spicy Hui Fong Food Incorporated sauce. Uh, it's a chili garlic sauce from the Canyon Road, Irwindale, California. And we're going to take this sauce and we're going to just, just spread it over this sausage, hanging on for dear life right there. Now. Let me, uh, let me fix this situation right here. Let's put it back to the safe lap, okay? Now there's the safe lap right there. And we're going to take this and we're going to put this sauce right, lay it right over the sausage so it melts on there, just like that. Just so it melts right over that sausage and it gets all those flavors kind of mixing in a bubble and, and uh, doing their thing. You know, it's just, uh, that is a beautiful sight right there. Very good. That's a spicy almond butter hot Italian sausage. Okay, that is great. That should be enough. Um, now we're going to take this seedless blackberry jam that I've been so excited about. And we're going to 
we're going to pour a little on there. Uh, we're good. You might have to just kind of help it out with your finger a little bit. And let's do it right there. A little bit there. And just put a little bit there. All right. That's looking good. Now, you just spread it with your finger. A little bit just like that. Mm. Oh. Okay. And last but not least. S for Shih Tzu. Okay. Now let's put this right here. And we're going to pour our coffee. Oh. Oh, yeah. That wakes you up in the morning right there. Ooh. Let's taste it. Ooh, that coffee's so good. So, so good. Mmm. Oh, very good, very good. Mmm, so smooth. So, very, very smooth. All right, now let's take a look at here. Which one do you want me to try first? The almond butter blackberry or the onion red pepper medley? I'm going to go with the almond butter blackberry. Mmm. Huh. Mmm. Mmm. So good. Mmm. Mmm. This is Chef Shitsu Shimatsu. <laughs> and I'll catch you next time on another episode of Cooking in Amish. Love nature, baby. We'll see ya.